going to be a super lightning fast hopefully video on um, first on opening sharing permissions so you get your file you go to the share button whether it's green blue or whatever this is the same for google docs google slides google sheets any of it um, a lot of students struggle because they don't see this down here anyone at maricopa this needs to go you need to click change and then you need to change from maricopa to anyone with link and um and you can just say viewer unless you want them to be able to give feedback then you can make them a commenter if you want them to co-write it with you and make full edits you can change that there um, that's it, all that is um, then we're going to click done after that um, i'm going to show you now i want to show you how to publish this so that you can then embed the code in to um, a web page namely canvas or a, a canvas post so we go file publish to web um, we want to say embed not just a link um, and it'll automatically we don't need it to do advancing of slides but we can actually so let's let's say every five or ten let's say ten seconds no that's too fast too slow all right um, start slideshow as soon as player loads restart the slideshow that'll keep it cycling this stuff doesn't matter as much but I guess it's good stuff to do um, so we want to publish and yes I want to publish this selection Yep, and so it gives me the code uh, for it gives me the HTML code, so I can uh, copy that, and I, you can right-click copy or use your Control C or Command C button uh, shortcut key. So now that I've done that, I'm going to go over to uh, my post, and I'm going to let's see, I'm going to try it two different ways. First, the way we've been doing memes um, by Actually, this is a little different because this is media, um, but the way I've been doing YouTube videos, but that works. So I can take it, um, so I'll walk back through that real fast. So when we've been doing memes, we were using the image upload and we just posted the URL. That's not what we're doing this time. What we are doing is the video and media upload and we want to say upload or record and then embed. And we can put the code here and just control paste or command, uh, uh, command V, control V to paste that in there. Or I think it'll let you right click and paste. Um, so there's that, that's one way to do it. The other way is fancier and you can go to this little symbol right here and and see the fancy code and what I can do is actually just paste that code in there I can also go through and change some of the dimensions if I wanted to um, and just make it like hundred percent and whatnot but I'm not gonna worry about that right now um, but now that I've changed this I can now flip back and I'll see two stacked because I've embedded and pasted um, so that's always cool but that's the simple version of it so uh, just to do a quick recap when we are in our Google Drive we want to make sure we open those share settings uh, we get changed this from Maricopa to anyone with link can view uh, we make sure and hit done or save as the menus pop up we go file we go publish to the web we click embed and set the settings as we like them um, wherever it is and then we copy that code bring it back over to whatever web page in this case canvas that we're wanting to use in canvas we have two options we can upload and record media and embed that or we can just go down to the html editor that they have here um, and paste the code in like that and that can be fun so um, that is the recap and so there are all kinds of fun html things that we can do if we want um, which is some of them are less recommended than others but with that we're gonna say we're all we're all done and so uh, hopefully this was fun enjoy let's see what it looks like if I didn't break it okay so now I can make a full screen ta-da and it'll let me it should let me click through or it'll just change every three seconds but since I only have one slide it's not gonna let me do any of that and 